Yeah, back on the street, man. About to go check out some condos today. Where are we going? You know the name of the place? All right. Back on the street again. Yeah, model of, what's it called? Nobleza? This is the Nobleza. The showroom is back there? All right. Here. Oh. One bedroom. One bedroom. All right. It's 38th floor. Mm-hmm. First and second floor will be the commercial area. Okay, and where's parking? 32th floor is the parking area. Okay. Mixed up residential. Oh, 11 to long is the two level communities. Mm -hmm. Then 15 up to 38 is the residential. residential. Ah. 15 is furniture. Okay. The example of the 29 square meter one bedroom. Yes, sir. Complete kitchen and bathroom. Oh, yes, sir. Well, they make these models look real good, don't they? Oh, it's also included. So you guys get cabinets and your air conditionings are included in this particular unit. I like the way they got it set up though. I'm not gonna lie. So it's the one bedroom. <laughs> and this one here is the uh, three bedroom. Uh, okay, kitchen area. Yes. We have maid's room. Oh, maid's room. Oh, okay. That's for example only. Oh, it's not open. <laughs> okay, so that's included. Okay, cabinets. Yeah. All right. The cabinets yeah. come, come installed. <laughs> the cabinets come with. Yeah. Yes. Dude, somebody was up in here cooking some meat. Okay. We have bathrooms. Okay. Let me see. I got it. It's not that bad. Okay. So that's your patio area over there. Okay. So bedroom number one. It's the master bedroom. Okay. It's pretty small. Your bathroom. I love the shower heads. The water features is almost included. All of the what? Yeah. No, okay. Right. It's the master's bedroom. We have only for you and me. And the master. Alright. Yeah, we're here now, just chilling. Not no blazer towers. That's their little pricing and stuff like that. Okay. In Manila, it's not half bad. Yeah. All right, thank you, have a good one. All right, nice you too. Whew. Boy, when you come to the Philippines, man, it's hot. Jesus Christ. Baby girl, what's up?
Walang pera ba? Sorry. Damn, thank God for learning a little bit of the language, man, because she won't go let up. <laughs> Boy, I'm telling you. <laughs> man, these Philippine streets done got a little rough for me, man. Nah, man, these streets done got a little bit too rough for me. I ain't comfortable. But I'm still here. <laughs> so guys, we just got back home from the condo view, the La Nobleza Terraza, <laughs> whatever you want to call it. And, you know, I, I mean, the condo looked okay. You know, the, the uh, setup that they had, I thought it was pretty cool. Then she was talking about how it was located near Manila Bay. We are already near Manila Bay, but you know, it's just kind of hard because what I'm noticing is when you really, really get down to it, when you're looking at the condos now and the one that we have right now, and you're comparing it to the new ones that are being built, you're running across the same problem that all of the condos are not being built the same you know the same materials the way that they're building they're getting smaller but the prices are getting larger it's just crazy now we've had this condo that we're in right now since early 2000 2003 2005 no at least 2003 two three between 2003 and 2005 at least we've had this one so this one was back when condo building was in its essence you know when the materials that they were using were really good and you know it was stable and you know the condo sizes are huge this one here that we're in right now is probably I know it's well over a hundred I can't remember how many square meters exactly but I know it's well over a hundred square meters but even the three bedroom that she was showing us that's only a hundred I'm sorry that's only 88 square meters so you realize damn you see what you're sacrificing so you know that's what that's what runs through my head and I can't think about buying a condo for myself and trying to compare what we have now to what I'm gonna get because you realize it's just not the same but I definitely just wanted to make this video so that you guys can get a glimpse if you are interested in buying condos here in Manila more specifically I'll do a shoot in Davao and we'll probably connect this video together with uh, the one that I'm gonna do in Davao you know just put like a couple of condo tours I'm not sure if I'm gonna check out another one here but I'll definitely make sure I check out at least maybe one or two in Davao so that you can get a comparison of prices I showed you the prices earlier so I just wanted to let you guys know that you know it's just hard to be able to compare the way that condos are built now to the way that they were built in the past because you know they're you know the sizes are different the materials are different you know and the prices are higher but the square meters are smaller you know the price per square meter is larger but the square meterage <laughs> altogether is really really small you Hold want on. to see the fish in Manila Bay unit? whichever one you guys have available that's yeah. fine okay. it's okay yes yeah mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, now. Okay, this is your studio, the back. No, oh, it's one bedroom. Oh, one bedroom. Oh, okay. The one bedroom is... It's a nice view. The price of this one is approximately 6.2 million. 6.2, okay. Because it's the view. Uh-huh. Alright. If you want this, this one, you can check if it's available. If we have available. Alright. 
Okay. It's a little balcony, that's nice. But you, so you don't know if this. The studio is facing Manila Base. So you have the CR. Okay. Let me get this one. We're looking balcony on this one. Oh, okay. Okay, so this is inclusive. Yeah. But long air conditioning? Or no? no air conditioning. No air conditioning, yeah. okay. Alright guys, so we just left the uh, second apartment. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. They only had available units in the studio and um, also available units in uh, the one bedroom. You know, I just wanted to give you guys a quick up, you know, upside to see the kind of condos they had available. Unfortunately, you probably didn't see the studio one very well because they had that dresser in the middle of the floor but you know the view's not bad from where it's at so you know that's just something to look into just in case you guys are interested in getting condos again I do recommend condos if you want property that is going to be in your name and your name only as a foreigner but if you're looking to do property better make sure the woman that you're with is the one you're going to be with forever <laughs> Just wanted to throw that out there. All right, not sure where we'll go next with the condo views, but we'll definitely put together another one so that you guys can check out some of the ones in Davao. But right now, still in Manila reporting live from uh, the streets of Malate. Dr. Mike is officially out. Make sure you stay tuned for the next one.